God's power made perfect in weakness. I know about one of Christ's followers who was taken up into the third heaven fourteen years ago. I don't know if the man was still in his body when it happened, but God certainly knows. As I said, only God really knows if this man was in his body at the time, but he was taken into paradise where he heard things that are too wonderful to tell. I will boast about that man, but not about myself, except to say how weak I am. Yet, even if I did boast, I would not be foolish, I would simply be speaking the truth. But I will try not to say too much. That way, none of you will think more highly of me than you should, because of what you have seen me do and say. Of course, I am now referring to the wonderful things I saw. One of Satan's angels was sent to make me suffer terribly, so that I would not feel too proud. Three times I begged the Lord to make this suffering go away, but he replied, My kindness is all you need. My power is strongest when you are weak. So if Christ keeps giving me his power, I will gladly boast about how weak I am. Yes, I am glad to be weak, or insulted, or ill-treated, or to have troubles and sufferings, if it is for Christ. Because when I am weak, I am strong. <laughs>